an affordable clinic and a VIP clinic are opening in Lalatown. Turn a plastic container into a doctor's suitcase. Connect the halves with a gold ribbon. Everything is covered in gold in the rich clinic. Wrap the container in chains like this. Add a red cross sign so you don't confuse it with a designer purse. We didn't know that La Louboutin has a collection for doctors. Decorate the suitcase with half beads. Even doctors in the clinic wear trendy accessories. Miriam has a headache. Oh, the music at yesterday's party was too loud. I need to call my doctor. Hello? Now what seems to be the problem, Miss Miriam? I have a migraine. Maybe it's because of the weather? Oh, don't worry. There is something in my trunk that will help you. It's a new painkiller that will immediately help you out. Dolls touch so many things during the day. Ew, their hands are probably covered in germs. Take a Lego part and a bottle with beads. Make a perfume cap out of the top part. Glue a piece of a straw as a dispenser. Add a sanitizer label. There is always a bottle with sanitizer on the reception desk, and each visitor can use it for their hands. Mmm, it feels so nice. Take a round beauty blender. Make a cut. Cut the center. Remove the middle part. Even the sides with scissors. We made a brace for a doll's neck. Ken, we're gonna help your neck. It's too long. Trim it. Make a clasp out of Velcro. Secure the Velcro to the sides. Connect the ends. Ken, wear this brace and your neck will get better very soon. We're done here. Try not to move around too much. Huh? Thanks, Doctor. Take plant leaves. They're fresh, but not a very efficient treatment method. Make a bag out of twine. Leaves will keep their medicinal properties inside it. The Affordable Clinic practices traditional medicine. It used to help when we were kids. Hopefully that means it will help now, too. Penny tripped and hurt her leg. She has to wait for doctors on the bench in the park. <sighs> we'll take some leaves and think of something. Doctor, it's so great you're here. Where does it hurt? Here? Ah! Now we'll use a leaf and it's gonna be better. Bye. Looks like she didn't get too hurt. The leaf helped her walk again. Get well soon. <laughs> Take a clear tube and put a sheet of mirrored cardboard inside. Trim the excess. Cut a strip of foam rubber and a strip of mirrored cardboard. Glue it to the top of the machine. Hide the attachment points under pieces of a straw. Cover the bottom with a cardboard circle. Take a LED light out of a bracelet and secure it to the tube with hot glue. Add rhinestone buttons. Make legs for the machine and a retractable couch out of thick cardboard. We value our customer's comfort. Here is the first patient. Hi. Doctor, isn't that dangerous? Don't worry, we have the latest equipment. Okay. Make an oxygen mask. Remove a spout from a bottle like this. Secure a thin wire to it. Add an elastic ribbon and an oxygen label. An oxygen mask will help you breathe.
After giving the little girl an IV, the doctor noticed that her breathing was a little irregular. Nurse, bring an oxygen mask. She got additional oxygen until her breathing went back to normal. Doctor, how is she? I'm so worried. Everything is okay. Blood got oxygen. The vitamin complex has been absorbed. Now, you may go. Thanks. I'm so happy that I can take her home today. Skewers are a functional material. Join a couple of crooked branches. Wrap the handle in rough twine. The rope is stronger than silk. The affordable clinic is as busy as ever. An old lady barely made it here. Thank you. Oh, honey, help me. Take a seat on the bench for now. And the doctor came back with a cane. That's great. I can swing it well. Oh, uh, maybe you shouldn't move so much. Well, let's test it. Knock, knock. Oh, it's just a dry branch, but it will do the trick. I'll teach the hooligans on my block a lesson. Oh, I hope no one gets hurt. Take a lid from a lotion bottle. Cut a piece of wire. Pull it through the openings. Give it the right shape. Secure it with a metal wire. Outline the lid on a cardboard sheet. Cut it out. Cover the inside part of the lid. Wow! Bend the end of the wire. Cut out the top part of a straw. Take a cap from a toothpaste tube. Make an opening in the center. An operation lamp is ready. It easily moves around and it shines so bright. Hello, good news. You're in great shape. We can start. We'll just need an operation lamp. We'll need a couple of droppers for the IV. Trim the excess. Fill the containers with gold glitter. Decorative attachments joined with pins to make gorgeous lids. A clear tube will serve as a base for the stand. A wire frame can hold the weight of the IV bags. Cover the attachment under a gold ribbon. Hang rings to the sides. Gold leaf is so delicate, using it requires skill. Add a lid. We need more gold. Containers with gold liquid are finally in their places. There is a long tube coming from them. Lack of gold in the body is easily fixed with the help of a luxury IV. The head of a zombie clan came to a doctor. Doctor, I'm running out of gold blood. Can we do something? I feel weak. We just got some new blood. The nurse attached an IV and the zombie felt better. It's already working. Don't rush, you'll need to take it slow. Thank you. Let's turn a perfume bottle into an oxygen tank. Glue the label to a bottle. Take a feeding tube of the right length. Put one end on the dispenser of the bottle. We need an oxygen mask. Use a silicone mold. Shape it as a mask. Remove the dried glue. The mask is almost ready. Secure the tube to a mask. It looks just like the real thing. Put the tank on a Lego part of the right shape. Apply hot glue on the top of a Lego part. Secure the tube. An oxygen tank is ready. 
Here's a mask. Now you'll take a couple of breaths and the anesthesia will start to work. Your eyelids are getting heavy and you're falling asleep. The doctors at the Rich Clinic think that money is the best cure. Why not put cash where it hurts? Perfect. Wound heal faster. Take a gold container for band-aids. Now they won't get lost. Hello. Doctor, I fell from the throne and scratched myself. Oh, poor thing. We'll help her forget about this unfortunate situation as soon as possible. I'll sit on the couch for now. Yes. Let's see. Well, we can use our latest thing, money treatment. These handmade band-aids are easy to use. Your wound is gonna heal right away. Wow. Thanks, you're a great doctor. Take a clear plastic container out of a toy chest. Use a head from an old tripod. Remove the wheel from a Lego part. Secure a wheel. We made a steady base. Secure the container to a tripod. Wow! Make a container for newborns. Cut it out. The lid for a box is ready. Separate a plastic ring from a Ziploc bag. Cut out an opening in the middle of the ring. Take two pieces of measuring tape. Secure it with hot glue. Put a soft blanket inside the box. This is the perfect place for newborns to go. The maternity ward is equipped with all the latest technology. Baby, you'll be warm and safe here. And when you're strong enough, you can go home. My beautiful baby, I'm so happy to be your mom. Cut a plastic container like this. Perfect. Bend thick wire to make steady legs. Wheels from a toy car. Don't give up, you're gonna drive again. This time we have a new mission, driving babies inside a tray. Add a blanket and the baby is comfortable and safe. He even slept a bit. The clinic needs an EKG machine. Take a clear box. Remove a lid from the base and join with hot glue like this. Cover it with tender blue acrylic paint. We can make the control panel out of a scrapbooking detail. Add a couple beads as buttons. Make wires out of cords. Add drops of hot glue and secure them to the frame one by one. Attach sequins as suction cups to the sides. Yeah, a new machine is ready to help patients. I'm Dr. Hannah, how can I help you? My girl needs an EKG. Okay, lay on the couch. I'll put on some suction pads. It's gonna tickle. <laughs> Well, let's see. Everything looks good. Your pulse is normal. You're healthy. Dislocation, sprain, fracture, a brace will help. Outline an insole of the right size on pearly foam paper. Measure the length of the bootleg. Cut it out and glue it to the insole. It's so sparkly. Now we'll decide how to secure the brace. Glue on ribbons and make clasps out of foam tape. Try it on the foot. Great, it fits! Ken sprained his ankle while skating. Well, let's see. It's sprained, we have to secure the foot. Put on something cold and add a brace. 
That's okay. But you'll have to walk like this for a couple of weeks. Thanks. I'll be as good as new by the end of the month. <laughs> we'll need a wire to make a walker. Bend it to make a frame. Make rails out of pieces of a plastic straw. Wheels from broken cars and Lego are gonna drive again. Join a pair of big wheels with the help of a straw. Secure the back wheels with hot glue. After installing the brace, we need to check how Ken's foot is. Does it hurt? Let's put on some anesthetic gel. Here's your walker. You'll have to use it for now. But you'll be skating again in no time. <laughs> One tea bag will be enough to make tea for the whole emergency room. Separate tea into small portions. Cover the edge and add a label on a thread. In a tea container, all the tea bags are protected from moisture. Enjoy your tea! It's very cold at the poor hospital. The heating is off, the walls don't have any insulation, and a doctor has to warm himself up with a blanket and hot tea. Doctor, my eyes are tired and they hurt. Will you help me? Take a seat on the couch, ma'am. I'll give you a relaxing compress. Where are my tea bags? Hold them on your eyes for a while and you'll see the effect. Would you like some tea? After a friendly conversation and a cup of warm tea, the grandma really started feeling better. There should always be sterile gloves in the laboratory. Take a container from razors and make an opening. Outline the missing wall on cardboard. We'll need it later. Put gloves inside and cover the side with cardboard. Paint the box blue. Glue on a label with a cut-out oval. And don't forget about Velcro. Now we'll know where the end is. And gloves will always be easily accessible. In the blood bank, the nurse is putting on a new pair of gloves for each patient. Come in. Don't worry, it feels just like a mosquito bite. Is that it? <laughs> of course. The results will be ready tomorrow. Come then. Ooh, a runny nose. We need a nose spray. ASAP. Take a lid from a tube with gel. And take a small part of a Q-tip. Join and put a cap on top. A clear rod from a pen. We just need to glue on the label. It's quiet at reception. Ah, chew! <laughs> well, almost. <laughs> Take a nose spray. Thanks. Ugh, these allergies. Fabric with gold sequins is the right material for a gorgeous mask. Cut out a piece and tighten on both sides. The elastic keeps the mask on the head. There's a gorgeous therapist office at the Rich Clinic. Molly goes to therapy regularly. Doctor, are you free? Of course, you're a VIP client. Molly, lay down on the velvet couch. Please, put on a luxury mask. Doctor, I can't do it anymore. I have the same nightmare every night. I'm drowning in my money. First, let's do breathing exercises. How are you feeling? Much better. Great! Our masks are filled with essential oils. They help you relax and make bad thoughts go away. Cut pieces to make foot covers out of a garbage bag. Seal the sides. A pair of foot covers is ready, but we'll need a whole box for all the patients. There is a storm outside. The roads are wet. It's dirty everywhere. Uh-oh. Where did these dirty prints come from? We need a mop. It's unacceptable. We need to keep the room clean. I'm sorry. The doctor made a pair of foot covers for situations like this. 
The patient cleaned her shoes with wet wipes. Now she needs to put on feet covers. Everything's clean. The doctor listened to her lungs. Good news, her lungs are clean. Thank you. The patient went home, and the doctor can start wearing feet covers all the time. Hygiene is a priority. A comfy chair is important for a dentist's office. Take makeup sponges. Cut wavy sides. Put them on cardboard shaped as a chair. Cut it out. The first one is ready. Now let's work on the rest. Make a leg stand out of a lid and a bottle. Cut a bottle in half and glue the top half to the lid. Now the couch is secure. Make handles out of bent straws so the patient will be comfortable. And also add soft armrests out of a sponge. Ready. People shouldn't be scared of the dentist. Even little Lucy is behaving well. Let's see. Great teeth. Good job. You don't forget to brush them. <laughs> Make a dentist stand. Cut out a bottom from a paper cup. This toy bowl will come in handy. We can use it as a sink. Bend thick wire with round pliers. One more bead, and the faucet is ready. Wow. Connect two bendy parts of a straw. Glue a clear lid to the side and paint it. Decorate with a thin strip of silver tape. Now the lamp is in place. Now make a panel for instruments. Cover one side with foam paper. And now instruments. Glue cutters to white cords. Hide wires inside and leave a sticky strip of double-sided tape on the outside. You can keep instruments on it. Dentist stand is ready. The couch is too. Come in. One more little patient needs to clean her teeth. Our new machine can do it very quickly. Whee! And no more tooth decay. Then they polished teeth with a cleaning paste. Now they're clean and shiny. <laughs> Make a tube of toothpaste. Press the end with tweezers and seal it. We can trim the excess. Glue on a bead lid and paint it with white acrylic paint to match. We just need to glue on labels. Kids need to learn how to clean teeth when they're little. After I examine you, I'll give you a tube of toothpaste for children. Yay, my favorite blueberry flavor. <laughs> We need a toothbrush. Cut a piece of a toothpick. And a pipe cleaner will be the bristles. The teeth are gonna be clean. You need to brush your teeth every morning and every night. A whole mouthful of foam. And it feels so refreshing when you're done. <laughs> Choose decorations and beads of the right shape. Secure a metal skewer. Glue a smaller bead to the other end. I'll use this to check how your joints work. Doctor, I hurt my knee while training and the competition is coming up. I'll examine you now. Don't worry, your injury isn't serious. Remove a metal part from a brush. Trim it. We'll need this tube of glue. Cut out a spout. Secure the metal part. 
glue on a printed name of the anesthetic gel. Wow! This gel is gonna help you. Broken headphones can't play favorite tracks anymore. But they'll come in handy to make a microscope. Take a piece of a straw. Glue on a headphone to a decorative hook. There must be a powerful lens inside. A mirror sticker can be used instead of glass. Glue a couple of rhinestones to the sides. Cover the top with silver paint. Now we can see even the smallest cells. Dr. Sue was sitting in a lab and finishing some tests when a patient came in. I need to do a blood test. Okay, make yourself comfortable. What an interesting sample. Your white blood cells are in the shape of a heart. Make a support with tubes. Bend floral wire with round pliers. Two rings on the sides. And it's ready. Now remove the sides without ink from an ink rod. Mix a beautiful blue color and pour a couple of drops inside. Seal the side with hot glue so it doesn't make a mess. There are so many beautiful tubes. We want to take a closer look. The doctor was busy studying samples under the microscope. Let's compare the contents of the tubes. How interesting. I need to write down the results. Cut a piece of wire. Give it the right shape. Attach it to the tweezers. Who needs urgent help? Now I'll work on your stitches. And tweezers will help me do that. <laughs> Remove one part from an old eyeshadow palette. Grind old eyeshadow. Clean a palette. Outline a container on a dried wet wipe. Cut it out. We made a container for medical instruments. A thermometer and a syringe will fit on it. Put a container near the most important instruments. The operation was a success, and you're getting better already. Let's give you an anesthetic shot and you can rest. I'll work on the bandages. Make elastic bandages out of a white ribbon. Apply hot glue to a toothpick. Make a roll. Secure a clasp out of a sticker foam paper to the outside of the ribbon. The bandage is ready. Put it inside the first aid kit. This bandage is the best. We'll bandage you up right after your operation. It will help you recover quickly. <laughs> there are so many beads in the suitcase. Glue two together. Now the first aid kit is always going to have medical ice. Kathy was riding her scooter too fast. Oops. Oh, I'm going to get bruised. I need to put something cold on it. Press it to the place where it hurts. It won't hurt so much, and the bruise is gonna get better soon. Thank you. But be more careful next time. Bye. Clean a toothpaste cap with a Q-tip. Install a cap. Cut the extra plastic. Now the bottle has a bottom. Cover with white acrylic paint. Glue on a printed vitamin name. Fill the bottle. Make it look like vitamins. 
add a lid. Doctor, what do you recommend for improving my immune system? Start taking some vitamins. Take one pill a day. 